I really wanted to do a bar that you could plop down in the center of Manhattan or anywhere in the world and have it compete on the same level as any other bar in the world. I'm Ross Simon. I'm owner, proprietor, bartender here at Bitter and Twisted in Phoenix, Arizona. Um, I got into the restaurant industry back in the day uh, down the Clyde Valley in Scotland, uh, washing dishes at my aunt's coffee shop. Very unglamorous. I went to college um, for hotel management. Um, I said that's useless, so I dropped out of that because I much more enjoyed myself uh, actually working in the pub down the road when I was actually trying to pay for college. I decided I want to come to the States and not just do the de rigueur normal thing of going to New York or San Francisco or these larger cities that know what they're doing. Um, I wanted to actually come to a, a city where I could actually start from scratch and really um, through the help of others uh, add to a community of uh, cocktail culture that might not have existed. It actually didn't happen overnight, it happened over a course of 10 years. Trying to raise the amount of money and capital needed is a daunting task and like when you're pitching it to people and they're saying this is far too complicated, this will never work and at the back of your head you're saying we're just making drinks giving people good times. It's not rocket science. We're just doing what we do to a different degree. If you look at our cocktail menu, it's very fun, very engaging, and we want that to carry on with what we're serving. For instance, our food um, really plays into that as well. We, we're not a restaurant that has a great cocktail program. We're a bar that has great food and elevated bar bites. You know, it's not fine dining, but it's great shareable snacks and we really wanted to utilize the flavors and ingredients that we use in our drinks, as well as being inspired in what we do with our food. I would love to just continue to grow, maintain, and making sure it's a great environment for people to drink. Perhaps can eventually turn bitter and twisted into an institution, um, and a place that's here 10 years, 20 years, like some of the great bars around the world. 